to make yourself important. Get the fuck out of here. You have to pay school fees to make me speak like this. Huh? The fuck? You have to pay school fees. Do you have to pay school fees? Did you even go to school? It's called educating yourself. Like, you use your Google. You have a smartphone. Use your Google. Ask Google how to pronounce word. Learn it. Like, just get to learn it. Jesus. You want to go on Nicki Minaj page and she be spe or, or, or on her live broadcast because you don't understand what finna or I'm not finna do that shit is. You be like, sorry, yo, you're speaking too much English. You don't understand. You want to get out of your bed, shift your nonsense back for you. Make a year with that big nonsense. All you guys like is Raz, Raz, Raz. But hello, I'm not Raz. I know how to speak English. I best believe I can curse you in English too. To fame last year mm -hmm. and the, the overwhelmness you get and sometimes it gets so overwhelming that it's not everybody that can control it and i i am somebody that is hot tempered okay. so everybody knows so at that point i was always falling into trap of hey, if you know this i'll just reply everywhere would just be hot again right, right. so i was falling into the trap but i i believed every reasonable person would know okay yes she's going through it She's learning. Right. You get, but then he was always making issues out of everything. I don't want this. I don't want that. Mm. Like, all right, no problem. Because if it was really genuine, some guys would be like, okay, I understand the pressure, everything. Right. I'm standing by you. I'm doing this, but he wasn't that yeah. way. So I like, okay, it's had not to, going to work. So to. let's move. Your heart too. Yeah. And again, were you also creating content with your ship? Life where we know that real love does exist in the Big Brother house. It's it not, the for ships me are not always about it. The, the does. It did. For me, it did. in my set, I mean, we have Bella and Shags, like those people, they're pushing it. Like when they came out, it was crazy. Like they were having so much backlash the way myself and the guy was also having the backlash. But Bella and Shags, they stood by each other. Bella will come, oh, Fina. And I'll say, calm down. <laughs> <laughs> like, like we were, yeah. I would say, Bella and Shags, we were able, I will add myself in, we were able to push it through that now, um, I feel Shags will get married to that girl soon. <laughs> soon. And I'm ready to wear my pepper red that she be an envy green. You get <laughs> So true love, people really That's get like true love from that. the house, mm -hmm. yes. What are you hoping of? Able to work in now, I can, I meet people. Even, even at my, at the, 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 the position I am now, I still see some people like, oh my God, I'm going to take a selfie, you guy. <laughs> So I'm, so I'm I'm so excited because I can now do a lot of things just with the platform of Big Brother right. and she won. You get yeah. so I keep saying it that Big Brother is Jesus Christ on earth. Uh -huh. I keep saying it that Big Brother saves 28 to 29, 28, 24, whatever housemen in the house saves them every, every year. year. Every That's year. why I keep saying it. Yeah. Right. It's not just to go on Big Brother. Do you have a skill? Do you have talent? And you have mind. Mm. Because you can't just come on Big Brother when you're not doing anything. Right. Yeah. Any you, negative you need to impact. have something to sell. Wow, yeah. so negative impact, as I said. Some people have tied their life around negativity. So there are some people like that, and they are much on the BBN streets. Yes, people that their own is just to downcast you, their own is just to say whatever they have to say about you, just to make you feel less of yourself. So that's it. And... I won't call this negative, but oh, it's too much. Like, I can't walk in peace. <laughs> I can't go around in peace. Like, it's always crazy. Like, sometimes when I go out, I know how much goes off my pocket. What I didn't expect. <laughs> oh, Fina, I know, do or something to you, mama. You get it. So, it's, it's a lot. It's a lot. Yeah. But, but you're handling it well. I'm handling it. Again, positive impact. Fina. <laughs> It took, it took. <laughs> Thank you. So you can't talk again. Great that you are, you're so pretty and don't stop being you, okay? Thank you very much. Alright, thank you so much. Let's go to the next one. Good morning. Yeah, or it might not be enough to even get food, <laughs> yeah, the proper right. food. True. So on Wednesday, before I go back to Nigeria, I want to do that, and I hope y'all come and support me. Definitely, we'll be there. Please, can you mention me to your fans so that they know uh, I'm, <laughs> I'm yeah, Africa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? I can't 
pronounce what's up my village people what's up what's happening how is your monday going hope you're having a mimi shosley day meanwhile welcome back to say with me shosley mimi where you get the gist i said i do waiting i said it hurts of course you know there's no sleeping on the best school on the channel if you snooze you do what you lose are you yet to subscribe to this channel or are you sitting on a fat long thing kindly pause right now subscribe then turn on the notification bell if not tell me how do you want to get the gist i said it hurts because gist to yakba these days in fact today you see this week this week is starting with a whole lot of gist guys i do not even know where to start from but trust me to start from somewhere guys so yeah guys so um there is a lot in this particular video but before we tend to start to talk about um the big brother actually i want to talk about the big brother ninja house but before we start to talk about them okay let me read this from my de la cruz she said I think Ella got wind of the BBN All-Stars gist and decided to start picking fights and stressing every day on life so they can see a storyline and pick her because how else do one explain this sort of nonsense? This baby's life every day, early in the morning, saying one thing or the other. So now guys, if you watch the video, the first video you came across before you start to see Fina's interview was that of Ella. If you have been following my channel, you would know once in a while I do bring in Ella's video because it's disturbing. It may seem as though she's going through psychological issues or something because the rate at which she laments, she will just stay and she'll start commenting and she'll call on Tacha's name and start yelling, blah, 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 blah. I, I hope you all know who Ella is. Ella was in the season of A Lady with a Golden Voice. Ella really do have a nice voice. She was in Tacha's season, yes, the Pepper Dem season where Macy AK came out as the winner. So at a point, you know, the netizens were worried about Ella. But yet she is not giving up. Now they are having it out since the news of BB Titan um, All Stars has come out. It may seem as though she's trying to be all this controversial and more because of she has heard of um that there will be a BB Titan sorry Big Brother Niger All Stars. But guys, Ella has started this way before you know. I think she would have even heard of this All Stars of a thing. Okay, what I think her problem is is high expectation that was not met. She is still. She's not, she has not gotten to it yet. She's this lady that has a sweet voice. Her voice is so sweet. I'm not going to lie, okay? And I know she she wants to use that Big Brother platform, you know, to sell herself. In her mind, she already registered it that when she comes out of the house, she's going to blow. She's going to do this and that. But coming out of the house, it was not how she, she, she wanted it to be. And it is giving her another thing. And now she's, you know, bouncing from left, right, and center. Anyways, I hope God be with her, okay? Because just the important thing we want to talk about. So let's go. And yes, it is the controversial Queen's birthday. Yes, Chomzy. <laughs> Happy birthday to you, Chomzy. May the good Lord bless your new age. And may all your hearts secretly desires. May God answer them. Amen. And I hope you're happy wherever you are. So yeah, guys, talking about Chomzy, okay, we all know what has been brewing about Chomzy since yesterday I've been discussing him on my channel here, okay? On the issue, you know, if you've not seen the um, video, kindly go back to my channel. It is sitting pretty right there. Now, being her birthday, Chomzy actually dropped something, okay? You know, sometimes these housemates act like some things do not get to them. But guys, believe you me, most of those words, those attack gets to this housemate. They might come up and laugh out on the social space, you know, and then they will they will cry privately about it. But meanwhile, Chomzy actually posted something on her snap, okay? And it is given that um she is mocking the lady whom she is pressed currently with her man. Okay, and people have been coming for her on her birthday and was attacking her and saying, All you could do in a day like this is, you know, mock a lady on your birthday. Let's see what she actually posted. Okay, this is it. She said, A pained, jealous ex once said, I am sorry. I know I messed up. Please take me back. A month later, let's drag Chomzy. She is the cause of my problem. Village people. So, yeah, guys, this was the post she made, you know, and people have been coming for her. They were like, so you're busy mocking a fellow lady you collected her, her man from. Is that the best thing you can do? You are not even, you are not even ashamed or anything. But guys, on the second thought, something just entered my head. You know, everybody might be bashing Chomzy now because of, yes, she's a celebrity, big brother, Niger housemate. Yes, they are known for being with men. But can you the other way and think maybe this guy and this lady are truly not together anymore? For there are some ladies are mean. I am even trying to say through experience because some ladies are actually mean. You know, when they discover that their ex is actually happy. They tend to shoot a shot. Some ladies are mean. Guys, true. 
Okay, Grossi said, this is highly insensitive of Chomzi. You are laughing at another woman's pains. You should have just stayed quiet. Okay, I'm, I, it's not like I am in support that she's, you know, tweeting all about and everything. But I am not to tell her how she, to react on what she has been getting because definitely they have been dragging her left, right and center. I even did not post most of the things they have been doing, saying to her. Okay, but on a second thought, let's just check it this way. It may be as, it might, it's possible she's, she does not have a hand. Like she do not really like per se break a relationship or try trying to you know snatch somebody's husband the way the the narrative is going okay but because of the way it is put out out there we we'll think it's kind of snatching dust and that one it is also possible that it's not going well with the guy and the wife anymore and they they've separated and then chumsy came in you know i mean my ways wait, don't separate with the wife no go get another love is it a crime so i think maybe it's this stigmatization is coming on this house because of they are big brother's kids okay because i do not see if i'm just saying you know not like i'm saying what she did is right okay i am just saying it is giving a two angle i have actually judged her the first instance you understand say when the narrative were given she you know she asked of somebody she you know collected somebody's man but on the second note with what she just posted why can't we take it the other way around but any which one it is i just hope chumsy did not hurt anyone in order to you know be with her man okay Let's talk about the main gist at hand, Odogu Fina. Okay, but before we get to talk about Fina right here, okay, I'm, I'm so glad to let you all know that Fina will be in the uh, um, Perfect Match Extra House, okay? I once asked you guys on my channel, one of my videos, I asked you guys, do you guys watch this Perfect Match Extra? So that I would see if I will be, you know, be bringing the gist to you guys. Well, nobody replied me, okay? Nobody replied me, but maybe their next season, if it's going to have next season, I would, you know, make analysis on that, okay? But for this season, I don't think I'll be making any analysis it may seem as though people do not really know about the show but it's actually interesting it's actually a a couple um reality t reality tv show where the couples are the ladies Ghanaians are paired okay but fina will be in the house she will be live by 9 p.m with the housemates today okay stay tuned to see your favorite you know being the celebrity in the house among the upcoming celebrities as she said your fave is going to be in the perfect match reality show tonight catch me live at 9 p.m catch me live at 9 p.m is going to be fun with the housemates stay tuned okay fina i would see you by 9 p.m definitely because i want to see how you would relate with the housemates so guys guys now let's talk about the gist as it hurts so fina had her interview today she said a whole lot with prime tv or something in ghana right we all know she's in ghana okay this is her first interview in ghana you know as they're attacking kosi in nigeria they're attacking um fina in ghana is giving <laughs> attacking of the winners you know easy to be winner wahala for people where we know so guys fina actually said something in that her interview she said that because she was asked about sheep in the house of course she said ships are cool okay checks and bella are actually digging it out okay you see the way she put it that they are digging it out you know it, it can never be perfect but they are pushing it okay now they, so she was asked about groovy you know, she was like, from her own end, she was genuine with Groovy. You understand? But later, she realized that Groovy do, does not love her. Groovy is in love with some other housemates. Now, the teaser is, who do you think that housemate is? Is it gonna, is it Chomzy? We all know two, there is two housemates that Groovy really do like. Groovy said it, Beauty and Chomzy. So, is it Chomzy who is currently dating someone now? Who is, uh, we're actually having her gist? Or is it Beauty who got disqualified through Gro because of Groovy? So, which of the female housemates is that? Because we see the people, the social space is like, hmm, but people are pointing at beauty. But the thing is, yeah, right now, they are attacking Fina. They were like, we are you not aware that Groovy do not really like you when you were forcing yourself on him? On, on the second note, I am not happy that um, they are dragging Fina. But first, guys, of course, Fina knew groovy does not really like her in the house yes we all know that feelings grow okay one of the reasons anyways this reunion go hot i am telling you so people should get ready to attack oh. people that cannot you know turn on their neutral mood on their setting turn on your head turn it turn it on to neutral mood so that you will understand me perfectly fina knew that groovy do not really bad her in terms of relationship but she actually fixed herself in now groovy actually succumbed because of the Fina takes care of him very well. Fina is sweet. Like, which guy no go once? It can't be Groovy that cannot even enter the kitchen to save his life, you know? And he's, he loves food, you understand? So, now, outside of the house, he, ca he cannot pretend for how long, Kwanu, for how long? There is no how you force yourself into a man that it will work. You understand? Now, but outside of the house, Fina had other things to do, so it will be easy for her, you know, to stay away from Groovy. Though in the house, Fina was saying that she she's 
that she's enjoying the moment. It's not like she's, you know, doing it that there will be relationship or anything outside of the house. Because many of the housemates actually, you know, warned her that Groovy, there is nothing for you and Groovy. She was like, she's enjoying her, her stay in the house and that is it, okay? But it may seem as though feeling developed. Anyways, even like I'm even talking about the reunion gist right now, but it is what it is because of the social space is actually hot on Fina, on her that um she actually knows, she saw fire and she went to put her hand inside of it. So they were like, she wouldn't have done that, okay? So guys, they were like, she wouldn't have done that, okay? She would have just been on her own because she would have definitely win. She would have definitely win even be with Groovy or not. She would have still won, okay? But anyways, what they had together also as spicy to the show. But guys, they are on Fina's neck and then the social space is not funny at all. Like they are like making mockery of her saying, you saw that coming and you went into it. You cannot force anything. No, they were not mocking her. You know, one thing netizens love is seeing this housemate being robbed in the potto potto. That is one of the favorite stuff from netizens. So that's why Fina's name has been on the social space. So the question still remains, who is this female housemate? But I think we will get to know about whom that housemate is in the reunion because definitely Fina would mention something like that. In, of course, they will discuss it in the reunion and we will get to know who that female housemate is. But it's between Chomzy or Beauty. Which do you think it is? Okay. Okay, your fave messed up and was thrown out. We understand why she's trying so hard to compete where she doesn't compare. Don't compete and kill herself for to prove zero point because you see Ijoma Josephine or Tabo, her grace is loud. The richest and most influential LU housemate. Hmm, the richest? You think so? If you say so, then so it is, okay? Um, who am I to say no? Who am I to say yes, okay? <laughs> it is your fave, okay? Everybody would say their fave is the richest, by the way. Meanwhile, Fina is actually doing well for herself because she actually said a lot in that interview. If I tell you investments, whether well, babe, they do. Anyway, there's a comment that has it and we'll read it together. Okay, so now people are pointing at beauty. That is why the person they are referring to here is beauty. Okay, I think they feel beauty is the housemate um, Groovy was entangled with, like really wanted to be with. Auntie Fe Fella said, um, I fear who no fear my country, Nigeria, Sha. Hypocrites all over the place. Them say Chom's a snatch person, man, with receipts all over the place. The news did not go viral, but Fina's interview, it's all over the place. Hmm, bloody hypocrites everywhere. The reason why this person is talking about Fina's interview going all over the place, not because of Fina had an interview. If it's just normal interview, this person would be happy that it's it's all over the place. It's because of this actual part of um, Groovy, where Fina discussed about Groovy. It's, it's actually going going viral and they are mocking her, saying when you went to collect somebody's man, when Groovy was not married. So that's why this person is saying hypocrisy at its peak, okay? Allow people embrace their friendship. Let's embrace love. What we see on social media is not always what it is. If people are wicked, let it not change you to a devil. It costs 0.0% to real and to be real and genuine. It costs nothing to love people and be nice. Finia media round in GH God. How I wish I can love this comment. Like I feel like if I see the person who owns this comment, be you a girl, boy, woman, man, grandma, grandpa, I will just kiss you. Like I will kiss you so deep that you'll be like, Mimi, what happened? Do you know why? I love people who have sense. It is not so hard to love. In as much as you do not have faith, you this so a person is not your faith. That does not give you the rights or the room to hate them. It is very simple. Why, why is this hard to, to know? Why is this very hard for people to understand? Why is it hard? Um, I'm happy that some people reason like me, Shai, they sweet me. Okay. Dossi said, since some, some of you are focused on irrelevant things, these are the relevant things. She says she bought two lands in Lagos and already started farming on, on one. She has a H2O factory coming up. That is a water factory coming up. She's feeding 100 people on Wednesday. She has deals lined up and she's announcing one immediately she gets back from Ghana. This is the good part, guys. Fina. Is one thousand percent hardworking. If you don't know, you just have to know. Even seeing her from the house, you would know it is this girl that came up from the street, street that was striving hard, and God decided to bless her. Hence, she win that money. I, I, sincerely, I could not ask for a perfect winner for that big brother and I just show. Sure, sincerely, Fina deserved that winning. I'm telling you, and she's making use of it one hundred percent. I'm actually proud of Fina. So, guys, this was what was happening. It's still brewing on the social space, and I see like I carry I'm call on a carry on a doorstep like I see the hot. Okay, so let's talk in the comment section. What do you think about all of this? okay i will meet you guys in the comment section right now i am standing with my full chest thank you so much for watching of course you know i love you Bye bye